codebook can also provide tools to enable the user to create C sheets or room elevation drawings automatically from the two sets of data. Again, we'll use Explorer to drag and drop the room or rooms that we wish to create C sheets from. Codebook will create a brand new DWG and place it into the following directory. The, co the sheet content tab allows the user to define how they want the elevations to be represented on the drawing, whether it be adjacent, horizontally or omitted completely, whether they want to elevate the group 3 and group 4 items, whether they want to include an equipment report on that drawing. The dimensions tab allow us to set up a search boundary behind and in front of the wall face for codebook to search for equipment for. We can also set things like tick marks or a grid scale to be overlaid on the elevation. We can set the plot scale um, for the C sheet. And once we're happy with that, we can hit Create. Codebook will then drive the CAD engine, in this case AutoCAD, to create a brand new DWG, locate the room, draw the elevations of that room, locate the equipment at the correct fixed heights on those elevations, clip XREF the plan of that room to the center of those elevations, wrap a title sheet around it, fill the title sheet in with some pertinent inf information from the database, drop it into paper space, and file it away and move on to the next one. When the C sheet is completed, I'll show it on the screen full size. I'll bring up that drawing now. One of the last ways to report information is to use theme views. This will take data from the database and allow the user to graphically show it on the drawing. For examples, we can do room labels, floor areas, zones, room data, door data, door labels, and clouds. To give an example of floor area, we can ask Codebook to show on the fourth floor all rooms that are over required area by a given percentage, in this case 10%, under area by 10%, show where the median range rooms are, the required areas is yet undefined, and also show where the circulation is. Cobalt will now colour all rooms according to the criteria I've set in the dialogue. Similarly, I can do the same thing for zones. Show me which departments occupy space on this floor level. And immediately I can see the lighter green here is the, is the antenatal care clinic. The darker green is the neonatal care clinic. Orange is relative rooms and so on. And Codebook will also put me a legend color the drawing based on any of the room data set here, 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 or here by simply selecting which attribute I want to color. For example, in this case, ceiling height, 
polyline source which is the fourth floor level and apply that hatch to the drawing. Immediately I can see where all the different ceiling heights are. Or just to give you another example, let's go and choose wall finish. Show me the different wall finishes for this particular floor. I can graphically see those very, very quickly indeed. That concludes this overview of Codebook software. Thank you.